Hi, welcome back to another quick guide. Today I'll teach you how to use StreamYard for reaction videos. And it's literally an easy process, so make sure to watch until the end of the video to know how it's done. StreamYard is primarily designed for live streaming and collaborative video production. Or it may not be specifically tailored for creating traditional reaction videos. You can't use it in a creative way to achieve a similar effect. And here's a general guide on how to use StreamYard for a reaction style video. So the first step would be visit the StreamYard website, link in the description below, and sign up for a free account. Once logged in, click on the create a broadcast or similar option to start a new session and choose live stream. Choose studio on source, then also choose your broadcast channel. So I choose my YouTube account. Now let us customize your broadcast settings, including the title, description, and other details. Then hit create live stream, then click allow mic and cam access, then hit allow. Now StreamYard allows you to customize by clicking on the settings, then guest. You can make some changes to how the guests can interact with you and how they will react to videos along with you. Now now you share screen hotkeys. You can load this feature or case and the hot case section. This can be a video from YouTube or any other source. Now provide a name and they display. Then hit enter studio. Use the share screen feature to display the video you want to react to by clicking shift plus S. Then hit on share screen. Go to entire screen, then click entire screen to choose it. Then hit to share audio, then click on share. Click got it. And now, as the video plays, you and your guest can provide live reactions, comments, and discussions. StreamYard offers features like on screen comments and banners that can enhance the viewer experience. Interact with your audience through the live chat feature. Respond to comments and questions from viewers in real time. And this is only a mock life. You can't see this on another device. If you are subscribing to this channel, the only thing you will see is none. Unless I go live and I think I will upgrade my plan to record on StreamYard. Now let's hit go live, then click go live again. Once you've finished reacting to the video and the broadcast, StreamYard provides options for saving or downloading the recorded video. Now after the live session, you can download the recorded video and edit it further if needed. You can add additional elements or trim parts of the video. Remember, while StreamYard is a versatile platform, it might not provide the same level of post production control as dedicated video editing software. If you need more intricate editing capabilities, you can use video editing software after the live session. Always be aware of copyright laws when using the reacting to content created by others. Unless you have the necessary permissions or are within fair use guidelines. And that's all for now folks. Hope you like and subscribe. Thank you.